Randy? I believe you know Mrs. Mason. I believe I do. Hi, Peg. Hello, Ed. Well, uh, excuse me while I lose myself. Would you like a drink? No, thanks, Ed. I've been wanting to talk to you about Cliff. Well, you don't make it any easier just sitting there saying nothing. What do you want me to say, Peg? I'd like to know if you really believe that Cliff didn't do all he could to save his men. What difference does it make what I believe? All the difference to Cliff, to know that you believe that he tried to save your father and the others. Oh, look, let, let's just forget it, shall we? How can you be so unfair to even think that he would run out on his men? Well, what do you think, Peg? I mean, down deep. Oh, look, sure, I, I know Cliff is your husband, but... You've seen the way he acts, as if he's hiding something. He's not, I know Always he is. on guard, as if he's guilty. I'm sure when he remembers, yes, he will... But you're not sure that he doesn't remember. Well, hi, Dick. The Board of Review has reached a final decision. The tragedy on Bugle Peak was unavoidable. No one connected with it will be held responsible. Well, that's fine. Great. 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 Come on, honey, let's get out. What's wrong now? The board cleared you. Yeah. Cliff, it's over. Over? Honey, all I know is I sweat out every fire call. I'm scared. I'm scared I'll freeze in the door when it's my turn to jump. I'm scared I'll blow the deal when I get on the line. I'm scared I'll desert my crew again. Again? you never did. I don't know if I did or not. If I ran out once, maybe I'll do it again. I guess I'll never have the chance to prove it one way or the other. If I know Dick, he's put me in cold storage for keeps. Henry, get off the maps. Go on, get off of there. Yeah. Miller's here. Send him in. Morning, Ed. Morning. Winkler's folks just sent us back. We figured it belonged to Winky along with his other personal effects. The three letters engraved there. That's all that's left. There's an L.E.R. in Winkler and one in Miller. Yeah. It was my dad's. Where'd you find it? Top of the ridge. Not on the rock slide, huh? No. Thanks. It's okay, hold it. Good shape. Shut her off. Hey, Cliff. Can I see you a minute if you're not in a hassle? Yeah, sure. Um, I'd better go check the tower. It needs propping, I think. Okay. Dick just gave me this. He 
sell it to Wink for his folks by mistake. Any idea whose it might be? You ever see it before? Maybe I can help you. That watch belonged to my dad. got into the rock slide when the fire started to crown. Yeah, yeah, that's it. I, rem I remember I, I told him to get into the crevices, lie down. But just then a, a, a snag dropped into the rocks and it, and it scared us. And then I... Oh, yeah, then everybody started to take off. Who wouldn't with a fire like that coming in? I, I guess they figured they could outrun the fire, but I, I could see they'd never make it. So then I... I yelled again for them to lie down, let the fire pass over. But I guess he couldn't hear me, because he kept on running. So then I... Then I, I grabbed a guy, and that was Pop. But when I tried to pin him down, he, he broke loose and he knocked me into one of the crevices. When I came to, the fire blown up. That's it, Ed. Well, you try to stop my dad at the rock slide. You remember now, don't you? Yeah, it all comes back to me, Ed. I even remember ripping off his watch and ID tag when I grabbed him. How well, come his watch was found on top of the ridge a long way from the rock slide? I don't know that, but I do know I tried to stop him. You never tried to stop him. You ran out on him. I didn't run out. I'm telling you, I tried to stop him on the rock slide. I remember. You never tried to stop anybody. Get out of here. what I believe. All the difference to Cliff, to know that you believe that he tried to save your father and the others. Oh, look, let, let's just forget it, shall we? How can you be so unfair to even think that he would run out on his men? Well, what do you think, Peg? I mean, down deep. Oh, look, sure, I, I know Cliff is your husband, but, but you've seen the way he acts, as if he's hiding something. There's not, I know Always he Always on guard, as if he's guilty. I'm sure when he remembers, yes, he will... but you're not sure that he doesn't remember. Cliff. Hi, Dick. The Board of Review has reached a final decision. The tragedy on Bugle Peak was unavoidable. No one connected with it will be held responsible. Well, that's fine. Great. 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 Come on, honey, let's get out. Cliff, what's wrong now? The board cleared you. Yeah. Cliff, it's over. It's over? Honey, all I know. I sweat out every fire call. 
scared. Scared I'll freeze in the door when it's my turn to jump. Scared I'll blow the deal when I get on the line. Scared I'll desert my crew again. You did, but you never did. I don't know if I did or not. If I ran out once, maybe I'll do it again. I guess I'll never have the chance to prove it one way or the other. If I know Dick, he's put me in cold storage for keeps. Henry, get off the maps. Go on, get off of there. Yeah. Miller's there. Send him in. Morning, Ed. Morning. Winkler's folks just sent us back. We figured it belonged to Winky along with his other personal effects. The three letters engraved there, that's all that's left. There's an L.E.R. in Winkler and one in Miller. Yeah. It was my dad's. Where'd you find it? Top of the ridge. Not on the rock slide, huh? No. Thanks. Rub her up a little more, Boise. It's okay, hold her. Good shape. Shut her off. See you a minute if you're not in a hassle. Yeah, sure. Um, I better go check the tower. It needs propping, I think. Okay. Dick just gave me this. Sent it to Winkler's folks by mistake. Any idea whose it might be? You ever see it before? Maybe I can help you. That watch belonged to my dad. This one. Thanks. 